Yo, how's it going, everybody? Welcome back to my Ratchet Click Let's Play. If you enjoyed the video, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Let's go. Get right back into the game. All right. So we are on planet Aridia. I think is how you say it. I have no idea. Like I say in every other video, I'm gonna butcher all these planet names. It's him, Skid McMarks. That man from the Infobot. In the flesh, little dude. You guys get a load of that epic space battle I was in? We saw you screaming for help. Uh, that was like a war cry. My agent and I got ambushed on the way to hoverboard practice. Did he survive the crash, sir? Yeah, he's okay, but I've had a little trouble getting back to my ship due to my sprained ankle. Oh, come on. If you can take out all the sand sharks, I just might have a spare hoverboard for you. We'd love to help you, Mr. McMarks, but Ratchet and I need to find Captain... One of your boards? Hmm. I've always wanted a decent hoverboard. Well, all right. You just keep that foot elevated. All right. All we got to do is beat these uh, simple uh, enemies and we get a board. Where'd they go? Up here? Oh, uh, these guys. Get out of here. Oh, there's 53 of them. Alright. Does it count if they spit out again? Okay, it just adds it back on. Okay. I collect all this stuff. Can I blow that up? Yeah, there's a bolt in there. I don't know if you can blow that specific thing up, but. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> A little bit more than I can handle there at once. Alright, just collect all these. I also didn't have the weapon I thought I did out. I was gonna try to explode them, but pick one out. Alright, we'll grab that one in a second. Oh no! I itched my nose, so I missed. Oh, I'm gonna die here. No! Oh, I thought one was gonna blow that. All right, that was a close call. All right, I need to keep at least a thousand of these bolts by the end of this mission, just because I missed that. Uh, the what was it last uh last uh i forget what it was right and that should be the last few in this little area i think there's some up here that i saw whoa or at least these things oh i need health was there another one or was that it? Yeah, there's another one. And then these guys. I don't know if doing this attack does more damage or not. Alright. Eight more. Seven more. Six more. I don't know. Okay, I see the last one. you dudes at the hoverboard races. You've just acquired a Gadgetron Z3000 hoverboard. Use your new hoverboard at the racetrack in Blackwater City on Planet Rilgar. Okay, so... Am I far from where I started? I think that's my lead now to it, actually. So... I'm gonna fly back to the last planet real quick and grab that thing that I need to buy. Because I don't know if I need it for anything else on this planet or in the future. Or 
soon feature. I don't know. Yeah, okay. So I'm going to make my way over there real quick, and then I will be right back. All right, now uh, let's buy the... Okay, swing shot. I definitely think we need that for the next uh, minute. Sweet. I bet Captain Quark uses stuff like this all the time. Ha! Real men can swing without silly toys like that. The two of you make me sick. <laughs> what was up with the big noise? Use it on standard versa targets. Oh, it's in red. If the target is out of view, use the L1 button to aim. Okay, so you aim and press circle. Dude, the inverted controls. Do I actually need to aim, like I said? I don't think I do, right? Yeah, no, definitely not. I was gonna say, I don't remember having to aim. I think as long as it's like within a certain radius and on your screen, you're fine. Alright, I'm gonna pause so I get back to the other planet again. Alright, just made it back here. Uh, do I go back where I was going, or is that it? No, that's it. Okay. So we just continue this way. Oh, I have the thing on, don't I? It does take more ammo for this gun to kill things like that, but... I feel like we get back fast enough to where it doesn't matter. Okay. It's not working out so good right now. I might just stick with uh, this guy right now. I know it works better like later on with different enemies. And it probably works better now. I think it's just because that guy was like elevated a little bit, so it, the aim was a little bit messed up. Alright, gotta make sure we collect every little bolt. Okay, maybe not every little bolt. That's a little low. Uh, much, but if it's in a little group, then I will. Alright. Oh, I thought that guy was gonna get me. I like how they just sit there and wave their uh, flamethrowers back and forth, even though they know they're not hitting anything. Me and my pretties. Alright. Oh god, he's gonna get me. Bro, why did he aim for the box first? There's an enemy right in front of him. Okay, so from here, I don't know if... Okay. I'm gonna go this way first, because the other way it looks like it might like wrap back around to the start. Alright, we definitely did need to get this, so I'm happy I went back for that. And bam, let's go. Ah, oh, come on, I definitely touched it. They're telling me that now after like what three planets? If you'd like, you can reverse your camera controls. Just select camera from the options menu. Is this the third planet or is this the fourth? I forget. I already forget how many are recorded. I think this is the fourth. Including the like training whatever. Like the first planet the ratchet was on. Valden, I think it was called. Oh, uh, that, that made me jump. Not because it was like scary, but I just flinched okay. Alright. Oh, yeah. I was kind of nervous I was just gonna like die there. <laughs> Alright, I think we're almost there. 
Has a little bit of a close call landing in here. I love that noise. It definitely sounds like a uh, Jack and Daxter. It's funny though, because um, it's two different studios. So Night Dog and Insomniac. And in uh, Ratchet and Clank 2, Going Commando, I think. It, once you get to a certain like apartment area, there's like a poster of Jack. Do you know the two uh, companies are like buddies? I don't know if there's anything like that in Ratchet and Clank. I'm, I think there is, I just don't remember. I don't know what that was there for, but... Yes. Using the latest in precision laser technology, the Gadgetron Trespasser is guaranteed to work on Gadgetron's line of Invinso lock security doors. Alright. Let's give this little buddy a try. Are mounted on each ring of the Invinso lock. Aim the lasers at the receptors on the outside ring to turn them green. All receptors must be green before the Invincible lock will open. So those are like the little little puzzle games that they have in here. I know there's some that go kind of like crazy. I don't remember if any of those ones get like too, too crazy. But I also don't know if it's this game or one of the later ones where you have to... Um, what was it? There's like these... It's like a little grid almost kind of thing and you have to like either kill things or stop these little like mice looking electric things from getting to certain areas. I don't know. You'll see them eventually. <laughs> Just some of them get pretty uh, fast and hard. Right. I forgot that you have to like actually switch. Hey, just want to grab those real quick. All right, and then just this last area, I believe. That kind of confirms that we had to go back to be able to like continue on because we need this uh, thing for later uh, planets. Just wait for him to stop doing that. See ya, buddy. What's up with that bomb? Dude, they're like... I guess if you throw them mid-flip, it doesn't go as far? I don't know. I feel like I've never had that problem before. Hmm. Let's go look at all the bolts. Can I just fall off this? Yes, I can. Oh, he almost got me. At least we're finally like racking up on bolts, like saving up. Oh God. Yep. Yeah. I didn't realize that those were next to me until it was too late. I don't think this area is like really necessary. Why did he die in one hit? Did I hit him before? Alright, now we can continue up here. I think there's something up here, right? No. I don't know. I guess I'm remembering wrong. I don't have the best memory, so <laughs> makes sense. Is that on this side? No. Huh, weird. I thought I remembered something being in like something like this. I love the music in this game. I don't know if I said that in like the last uh episode or not. Which, if you made it this far, um, comment what game has your favorite, like, music in it. One of my favorites is, um, Time Splitters 2. That's, like, one of my all-time favorite, like, well, PS2 games, of course, and then music-wise, one of my favorite games. Alright. Oh god, I did not make that. Alright, let's just hop up here. I think I can make that, but... 
I don't really need to. No signal whatsoever. This downtime is killing me. Do you need medical attention, sir? Don't be so literal, son. The problem is I'm stranded on this backwater planet and my star client is nowhere to be found. Hey, we saw you on that info bot. You're Skid's agent. Was Skid's agent. I haven't seen him since our ship crashed. And an agent without a client is like a flea without a dog. Say, you look like an athletic kid. If you can bring back the championship prize from the hoverboard races in Blackwater City, I'll make you my next star. We have no time for trivial matters, sir. Hmm. I could be the next Skid McMarks. <laughs> That's all he cares about, not even like, you know, saving any plans or anything. Alright. So now we got a mission. Gotta go win a hoverboard race. Which I don't know if that's next or not. I think it might be. Because they just gave us the hoverboard and now it's asking us to win the race. No, I didn't mean to do that. I didn't even collect these. Alright, this time stay away. I almost just landed on it again. Alright, let's get back to our ship. Actually, let's check this real quick. Is there anything to buy? Other than ammo? Nope. Okay. On to the ship. Anything else here? Mission, spring, prize to agent. Boom. Okay, no. Alright. Off to... Idoria? Is that a silent E? I don't know. <laughs> Let's head there. Yes, quite lovely. That should just about do it. Commander, we are finished with this world. Commence towing our planet to its next destination. Lieutenant! Yes, sir. You have fulfilled your tree quota. Barely. We are ready to return to base. Not so fast, Lieutenant. Just because we don't need any more trees doesn't mean they should have them. Destroy everything. All right, well, we're on a new planet, so that means that is the end of this episode. If you enjoyed this video, please feel free to leave a like, comment, subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. Thank you for watching.